What's up guys? It's Jack from Diamond Wake here in a bit of a different video than normal, but as you can probably see by the title, I have very unfortunate news in the fact that I have a torn ACL. But the even weirder part about this is that I've been able to live with it for almost a year and it hasn't set me back at all. I swim competitively in college and I was able to do my whole swim season with no setbacks. So that really surprised me. But once our season ended and I started to do more on land sports that required impact and pivoting and all that kind of stuff that requires knee strength, I realized that my knee still hurt from the summer before where on this, this tantrum right here that you're watching right now, I thought that I just hyperextended my knee and it eventually healed enough to where I was able to wakeboard the rest of the summer. But the fact that the pain didn't go away after almost a year, I was like, I need to get this checked out. And I got it checked out, and apparently I have a torn ACL. So that means I will not be able to wakeboard this summer, and I will be stuck doing PT for around six to eight months, however long it takes me. So that is a really big bummer for my summer. That rhymes, take that. Because of my new experience, I also have a new bit of advice for anybody who's trying to learn the tantrum on a wakeboard. If you're going to land, make sure that your leg bends. Don't keep your leg straight because then all the impact goes to your knee and then you will really mess stuff up. Take a lesson from me and bend those legs on the landing. Very important. I do have my surgery tomorrow Probably in the morning, they're gonna call me in about an hour or so and confirm when I have to come in for the surgery. But I had my MRI a little bit earlier in the week and they discovered that there's no meniscus damage for those of you who know what that means. And it's a full grade tear. So basically there's no ACL there at all. And the no meniscus damage is a really important thing because that means I'll only be in crutches for about a week or two instead of not being able to put weight on it for four to six weeks. So that's a really nice not setback that I'm really taking as a big W. Also, I don't think I'm really that good on the crutches. I got a very small introduction and they kind of just had me walk in place for about 10 seconds and then do one set of stairs. And that was all the training that I got. So. Not being in crutches is really gonna help me out here. In about 15 minutes or so, I'm actually going to be getting a special delivery, which is going to be a little personal PT at home kind of thing. It'll be this little stationary bike. It's a little program that the doctor who's doing the surgery on me is starting as a way to have PT sessions to get your range of motion back and your mobility back, where you don't have to go to the PT center and waste insurance because there's only a limited amount of PT sessions that they'll provide for you or something like that. So I will own a personal little bike thingy. So now I'm off to go scrub my knee with this soap thingy, Hebe Cleanse, very fancy. I'm gonna go scrub my knee with that and I have to scrub it again before I go to the surgery in the morning. And after that, I am fully ready for my surgery. So I will see you with a new ACL. Well. This is me post-surgery. It's actually been a day because yesterday I was sleeping way too much and I had no motivation to do anything. So today I'm filming again and I'm going to be doing a lot of icing on my knee and a lot of laying down on my couch and doing nothing because I'm in a lot of pain and I do not want to move, but I'm going to have to at some point, which is the worst part. But this is my summer now, and it's very unfortunate. And I suggest, if you can, to keep your ACL intact. Because tearing it sucks, and it limits you a lot. But that's going to be the video. I hope you enjoyed it, because I really didn't. But even still, you should like, you should comment, and you should subscribe. Because we're trying to grow as a YouTube channel, and... This will be the summer for Luke to blow us up because I won't be doing much of that. So, hope you guys enjoyed and hope you guys have a lot better summers than I will. Peace.